What you don't have in your head, you have to have in your feet. It's a figurative Southern American expression that emphasizes the significance of practical skills and resourcefulness when you lack knowledge or competence in a specific area. What you don't have in your head, it alludes to the lack of knowledge, information, or intellectual talents in this context. It implies that there's some things that you might not be aware of or even understand. The second portion of the adage, you must have in your feet, refers to the idea that you must compensate for such deficits by depending on your physical abilities, instincts, and or your practical knowledge. Essentially, the adage advises you to rely on your physical ability, practical skills, or on-the-ground experience to navigate and solve difficulties if you lack the essential information or intellectual prowess. It highlights the importance of being inventive, adaptive, and prepared to rely on bodily senses and instincts to compensate for your cerebral deficiencies. Overall, this proverb serves as a reminder that there are several approaches to and solutions to problems. And that practical abilities and hands-on experience can be just as, if not more, significant than theoretical knowledge alone. It promotes people to be well-rounded and versatile in their approaches to problem-solving and the way they look at the world. So once again, let's hear it one last time. What you don't have in your head, you have to have in your feet. These are interesting things with J.C.,